hello i hope you are doing well this session i'm gonna talk about one of the questions which was frequently asked by my by my students how do we can get access to the elevation code of a specific point in relation to the level by creating a block actually most of the users which are working with the elevations are challenging with such a problem since some tools and and plates um should be installed and then the elevation is going to be added so we can get access to the quotes and they want to determine the position of the plates or whatever objects and the heights of them in relation to the levels by scripting quotes and then get access to the values of the base or top offset values for the plates so at this session i'm gonna give you a technique to just come over these challenges so easily but note that you should already be familiar with the dynamo block and the attributes that all of these are instructed on the comprehensive course of AutoCAD. First of all, from the insert tab, I open the edit block editor. I specify the name, level, OK. Then I sketch a line here, not point 0.2 for the distance, two lines vertically and horizontally. And then by using move tool, I select the two lines to just place these two lines at the base point. By this way, I specify the base point. Well done. Then I open attribute definition. Here we need two values. The first one is the reference value that it returns us the code as the reference. And the second value is we want um, the defined formula. I mean, I'm going to define a formula that it gives us the a value as a result, which is related to the specified point. So I open definition, I mean, attribute definition. I name the tag level i make it invisible it is not required to be visible we just wanted to act as a parameter and then the default value is zero and then the justification middle left and the standard text style or whatever you want then i click on the line by this way then i define the height zero as you can see and i press enter to move it well done. Again, I click on attribute definition to add another tag. I name it point level. I uncheck invisible since I want it to be shown. I specify the value 0. The text height not 0 0.06 and middle left placed. Check this out beneath the level. Let me move it a little bit upwards right now the blue line is the reference line with the reference point for the point level. I pick vertical measuring or measuring the dimension by this way then i associate the dimension to a parameter as you can see i name it distance then i double click on point level tag since i wanted to show the height then in edit attribute definition i remove or delete the default value i right click and then i click on insert field after that in field dockable window i choose object by this way for the field category then i choose formula and then i'm gonna define the formula here again i right click insert field again object as the name i select the value of the level tag i choose the property of value as you can see okay so right now we got the value then i subtract it from i subtract it from distance again i right click to insert another field which is distance here in block placeholder i add the parameter of distance which was just created and then the precession okay okay finish let's check it out enter i save the changes the name was the saved name was level as you know well done after that assume that here we got a ramp on which we got some plates check this out here let me draw a uh, x line and then from insert blocks i select the created block then i can place it at the desired point like this point i click on it as you can see we can check the height look i select this line and then by click and drag i extend it by this way or e enter as you can see this is the diff distance between the level and the plate and if i measure the distance check this out 92 centimeters again i choose the block to place it on other plates for example beneath the plate i select and then click and drag or enter in order to get access to the height or distance from level but the entered value is zero let me check the 
positive values here i can select these two here as you can see the code is minus 5.48 here if i specify minus 5.48 for level and then i in re enter right now the code or the height is considered in relation to the base point and this is wonderful since it can be very useful in your projects in positive or the negative level that you can get access to the height code or the height value in relation to the level or in, rela in relation to the base point don't forget to share this file with your friends